They're trying to hijack the system. That's one accusation aimed at five people behind a lawsuit delaying construction of a new Hinsdale Middle School. CBS 2's Dana Kozlov reports dozens of people who want the new school took their frustrations to the streets today. A protest isn't a typical after school activity in Hinsdale, but the fight to build a new middle school here is at a tipping point. Five people have kind of just used a technicality which was corrected to uh, go ahead and hijack the system and try to get their way. Parents and students in favor of the project are protesting the battle between voters and five people suing the board to stop the project. It started last fall after voters approved the $53 million school, but the five opponents, realizing public notice about the vote was posted two days too soon, used that as the basis of their lawsuit. After our story in March and a judge tossed the suit, the plaintiffs filed a motion to reconsider. Consider. This is nothing more than delay tactics. The plaintiff's attorney disagrees, telling me the line was crossed here. It raised an issue about constitutional law. But now the plaintiffs have offered the board a deal. Details kept private, which they say costs the taxpayers no money, keeps the project on time, and improves transparency. But many voters say that's not how democracy works. What they're doing is they're usurping our country and our democracy by going around the voters and what they intended. District 181 superintendent did not return calls for comment tonight. The plaintiff's deal is expected to be discussed in executive session after the public board meeting this evening. In the newsroom, Dana Kozlov, CBS 2 News. Robin Erica. Okay, Dana, thank you.